Hello and welcome to FPS Coach, my name is Ron Rambo Kim and in this video I'm going to talk about a technique called glassing and share a few tips regarding vision. Glassing is a technique used in hunting to scan the eyes across a wide open landscape for activity, preferably from a high vantage point. In video games, we also use this technique, especially in open map games like Apex Legends, PUBG, and Fortnite. When glassing, here are a few tips and methods to consider. Start by scanning the areas where you expect activity the most likely to be, like hotspots and predicting movement and the pathways. Or you can start by scanning the areas that are easiest to clear, like open areas and locations with minimal cover and details. You can think of the scanning process as sectioning the land into segments and chunks and clearing them one by one. When using the eyes, it's recommended to scan vertically and horizontally as this orientation is faster and it's also natural as this is how we read every day. Another cool feature of our eyes is that we can zoom them in and out and change the focus from narrow to wide. For example, try focusing as narrow as you can on the very tip top of this center tree and see if you can pick out the details of its leaves and branches. Now let's try the opposite and zoom your focus all the way out so that you're not really focusing your eyes on any particular spot, but trying to widen your gaze so you can see as much of your peripheral vision as possible. It's the feeling as if you're staring out into space and not really paying attention. Here's another example to try. Focus as best as you can on this tiny dot here in the middle of the screen. Really laser focus on the center point. Now let's do the opposite and zoom them all the way out and try to observe all the little dots and flashes across the screen. We're not really paying attention to any one specific area, but the picture as a whole. As you're doing this, you may notice that your eyes are focusing in and out at varying degrees, from narrow to wide and everything in the middle. This nifty feature of our eyes to quickly flick around and zoom in and out of detail is also helpful when reading. When reading, it's much quicker to scan and flow through the words when the eyes are zoomed at the perfect amount. For example, it is not efficient to zoom all the way into a single word where you can barely see the next. The optimal zoom would allow enough focus to see several words ahead into manageable chunks. For this particular reading format, the page is wide and the eyes need to scan several chunks from left to right. If we downsize to a more narrow width, the eyes can now read from left to right in 2 to 3 chunks compared to the 6 to 7 chunks in the wide page format. If the page is even more narrow, we can finish a line in 2 chunks by flicking and focusing the eyes on the left center and right center of the text body. So the next time you're fragging out in your games, expanding your knowledge, or gazing into mother nature, don't forget to take advantage of those wonderful pair of eyes. Well, that does it for this video. Hopefully it was helpful in some way. If it was, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to stay up to date.